everybody. Um, today we are going to be working on drawing shape robots. So I'm going to show you a couple of different examples here um, kind of quickly. I want you to make up your own robot using whatever shapes you choose. I don't want you to draw one that looks exactly like mine, but I will show you kind of how I would make one. So to make a shape robot, I think the first thing that I want to decide is what shape is my robot's head going to be. So I think I want my first robot to have a triangle head. So I'm going to draw a triangle to make my head. And then I can give my robot little robot eyes and a little robot smile. Um, and then I'm going to give my robot, let's see. So once I have a head, then I need to decide on my robot's body. I think I want this robot to have a heart-shaped body since it was just Valentine's Day. So I'm gonna make a little neck going down and then I'm going to make a big heart-shaped body. So, heart, my goodness, my kitties are fighting. Heart-shaped body. And then maybe I even want to put a rectangle on the inside because that's like the little panel that shows all the robots little like buttons. Beep, boop, boop, beep, boop, 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 beep. All right, now my robot needs either we could have arms and legs just coming straight out or we could get real fancy with it. And maybe this robot is on wheels. So I'm going to do a rectangle and then I'm gonna put a circle on the end so our robot is like a unicycle robot I'm even gonna make it look like a bike tire so this is how our robot gets around our little love robot so there's my robot's legs um, and then the robot needs some arms so let's see we could do maybe I want to do rectangles again just make like some long skinny arms coming out and then maybe my robot will have square hands with some little robot fingers coming out wow this robot's got really big hands doesn't it And then maybe my robot has an antenna with a little star shape on top. And that's my shape robot number one. Okay, so I'm gonna draw one more. Like I said, I don't want you to draw these exact robots. I want you to make up your own. I just wanna show you how we can take different shapes and make up a robot using them. So for our next robot, let's give this one, like, let's give this one a head like a stop sign. Um, is that a hexagon? Oh my goodness, I don't know my shapes. Um, so we've got stop sign head here. Um, we could even make this robot into a kitty cat by adding triangles. And give it a nose and then let's make this one. Maybe this one is like a mad kitty cat. So here's our kitty cat robot. We'll give this one two antennas um, and we can give it heart shaped antennas. So we've got triangles, hearts. Um, the stop sign shape that I can't remember the name of it that you guys are probably all gonna scream at me when you watch this video. Um, now let's give our kitty cat robot a body. So maybe we can give our kitty cat robot a diamond shaped body. See, we're getting fancy with our shapes here. So then we've got our diamond body for our kitty robot. And then let's see what other shapes could we do. We've got 
triangles, we've got diamonds, we've got circles, we've got hearts, um, we've got squares and rectangles. Oh my goodness, what other shapes? We could even do, hmm, let's see, we could give this kitty like some kind of like silly like peg legs. Um, This poor kitty. It's going to be clomping around. I don't know how this kitty is going to walk. Um, and then maybe this kitty robot has, um, well, it needs arms. Um, let's give our kitty robot, let's just give it some like crazy loopy, loopy do arms. I'm not sure what shape that would be, but it's fun. And then we'll make it like that so it looks like it's like a tube. Or that could be the kitty's tail. Ooh, and maybe there's like fire shooting out of the kitty's tail because it's a crazy angry kitty robot. Maybe this kitty robot, maybe this is its front legs and we can give it paws with some circles. And then we can pretend that it has back legs back here that we can't see. And that can be our shape robot number two. So as you can see, I just want you to play with shapes. Um, if you want to make your robots into animals, that's fine. If you want to make your robots just be robots, that's fine. Um, I just want to see what kind of things you can make with different geometric shapes. And if you need help finding some shapes, there are examples in Seesaw um, for you to look at.